How's it going, everybody? Ragus here, and welcome to Nocturnal Visit, any horror game where you go visit a house at night. Didn't really say which one, so let's get into it. And I'm ready to. Am I ready to leave? Probably not. Uh, yeah, always take emergency cola with us. When the crosshairs turn red, you can interact by pressing E. Oh, okay. Good to know. So, do, do I need to pick up my boxers? Do I go to bed? I mess with my stuff at the house. A car battery. I have to clean my room. We should probably clean before we go wherever we're supposed to go. That'd probably work out best. Uh, any notes or anything I need to work with? Possibly, maybe mirrors, lights. Check my laptop before I tried. Wouldn't let me. Oh. Um. Spookiest haunted house. This is a this is no normal house. Its backstory even helps to add to the spookiness. Built in the 60s, this house was home for several serial killers. Nowadays, it's nowadays all it's left is the remains of the lives that were taken. <coughs> Sorry, all it means is the lives of that were taken in this place. But why is it still a mystery? Numerous reports of disappearance have been made. After normal or after some people had visited this house, we do not recommend to explore this house by any means. It's not safe and you might not return from it. Yet somehow we're going to tell everyone about it. Hey, look, it's even on itch.io. Th that. I think that's the actual URL for the thing. That's neat. I thought Lumen got in here and he scared me. He's not in here, though. I don't know why. Thank you. Oh, we just drove here? Okay, press F for your flashlight. Why do I park near the creepy houses? Hopefully that didn't announce that I was here. We'll go ahead and... It's locked. I'll look for another way. Of course it's locked. We'll go around back, hop the fence. Hello? Okay. Crash with blood in it. Anything in the windows? Try the back door. I feel like there should be something there. Oh, this house is haunted, so we know it's not grandma's. Oh, let's go to the basement. At least to the basement. Okay, right, what's this door lead to then? Bathroom. Crack the window, mirror. Oh, that works. Sink work? Up work? Uh, let's see, what else we got going on around here? Ooh, got some cooking. Doesn't seem edible. Look, you don't know what people can eat and can't eat. Have you tried some people's cookings? I will not recommend everyone's, but I can recommend some people. Leftover pizza. What else we got? Something's dripping. Dishes. Who puts dishes under the counters? I put mine up top. Actually, people, where do you put your dishes at? Let me below. Do you put it on the counter? Lace potato chips. If I remember correctly, I think that's uh, salt and vinegar. Could be wrong. Fresh in the freezer. Uh, you know, I can actually understand. I can get by that because of the fact being of you know sometimes bacon grease and whatnot. I don't know what book that is. Fresh. This place is such a mess. Yeah, this seems, probably seems like your house. Yeah. Or at least to the garage. So we probably won't be going in there. That was on my footsteps. <laughs> yeah. No. I didn't jump on what you're talking about. Phone is dead because phone has no wire connected to anything. Makes sense. 
Nice comfy bed. Okay. Yes, we gotta go to the one place I don't want to go, which is the attic. But the basement would be the b bad one. Let's go ahead and climb. Ah, teddy bear. Nope. Uh, I'm gonna have to get through with it. It's a fax machine. Garage key. You're not connected to anything. Why are you? Gonna mess with that? I'm gonna keep messing with it. Anything else happen? No, just the one face. Nothing's behind me. Always gotta search the entire area. Never leave anything unturned. Well, at least the fax machine didn't tell me how to pay my taxes early. I... Help. There we go. Thought I, thought I broke the game all of a sudden. Can't go in there, I wonder why. Alright, let's go to the garage. How about we don't go to the garage? I, I thought I'd take my chances with the weird computer upstairs that was turning on, but okay. What fail? Also, this car has no tires. Tires right there's. I think a hammer as protection or a pizza box. How about this basement key? Or did something run out of the locker and I just okay. Is somebody summoning demons here? Abaloth, is that you? You go to the basement, Abaloth? I'm coming downstairs, Abaloth. If that's your name. I'm going back upstairs, Abaloth. <laughs> How are you squeaking? You have no metal parts. Or do they? Get some WD-40 on that. I had to fix my house earlier with that. Update 1. 1.43 a.m. It is currently 4.03. The house just seems abandoned overall. Nothing has happened at 1.51. About 10 minutes in, I'm starting to feel a bit overwhelmed. I really don't like the environment in this place. I've heard several weird noises. And I feel like I'm on the phone. And I feel like I'm being watched. Day three at 202. Getting in this place was a completely mistake. Complete mistake. Something is definitely stalking me, but I can't see it. 205. The door is locked and I got no way of getting out. I'm screwed. Update five. Something is coming to the basement. I know the phone upstairs is ringing. I don't care. I want to know what's coming to the basement. Also, was that dog food downstairs that I was seeing, or was that like something else? Because somebody living down there? I don't know. Coming, I'm coming. Hold your horses. <laughs> Ma'am, I can't help you for crying. And also, my phone's broken. I thought something was gonna be behind me. I get in this door. Back door just open. No luck. Hello? Nothing there. Hi! Whoa, too close. Too close. I can't move. Okay. Alright, so that was uh, Nocturnal Vision. Interesting little game. Uh, I liked it. A little creepy. Didn't really overstay its welcome, but it's fun. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a like. Comment down below what you think of what other games you want to see me play. Share with a friend. Subscribe if you haven't. And as always, folks, keep on gaming.